in a world like none other. There comes one man in search of plastic, in search of cons. He is known as Plasticon. Join him as he brings toys from another dimension to a household near you. back to yet another plastic con on the air. Today we're going to cover Robots in Disguise R.I.D. Car Robots Optimus Prime. This was a Target and Walmart exclusive only to get this paint scheme of him being yellow. What he was, was yellow. Yellow. I mean, really, yellow? What? When was Optimus Prime ever yellow in anything? Does anybody remember that? I don't remember that. This might be like a Shining Magnus, but the Magnus wasn't even in this mold. So, go figure. Pretty much reminds me of um, Grapple or you know, one of those larger trucks like that. I mean, they could have repainted it blue and gave us a hot spot. I mean, come on. Anyway, let's go into this toy. He's got an articulated ladder. It goes around, and that's about as far as it goes. It goes up and down. Doop, 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 doop. And it's also got like this squirter thing here on the end. It's got a lot of detail, actually. You see the barrels? Very interesting. Do you like the molded detail on it, though? Can't really complain. Do you like the silver windows? Kind of a nice touch. And the Autobot symbol's kind of odd on this one. It's just tampled red, with no background, so it's kind of difficult to really see. But, you know, it just kind of felt cheap to me. I, I don't know what it was with this one. But, you know, they did pick out the light bar. I picked out some detail on here. And, yeah, a complete robot cable on there. Anyway, transformation! Pull out the legs. Take this thing here and flip it over to the side. And take this in and push it in. Flip this all the way down. I just kind of flip it down to about that far. And then pull out his arms. And then there you go. And then sometimes you can take this and put this forward. These do spread out. If you want him to have a stance, but it does rock backward very easily because it doesn't have any heel spot. I mean, look at this. I think this is where they really could have like engineered something. I don't know. I mean, look at this is a big chunk of plastic. They easily could have done something with that. I mean, I understand it's a spy chain. You're supposed to have simple transformation, but the easiest way to repair this problem is to take this entire ladder portion here and bring it all the way back. Lock it in the position and then just stick it back there like that. And that fixes this issue. He actually does have head articulation, which I have yet to figure out why the... I mean, I understand they probably gave this guy the most articulation because he's one of the most iconic of the group, but it's yellow. I just... I mean, look at the head sculpt. There's so much detail there, but they didn't paint it. What, what, what gives? But it's a yellow prime. Yeah. Could have named you Rector. That would have got a laugh. But anyway. There is Transformers Optimus Prime R.I.D. Walmart exclusive car robots. Spy Changer style. Today we're going to cover R.I.D. Robots in Disguise Car Robots Optimus Prime. He's a fire truck. A very cool fire truck. Do love this fire truck. It is humongous compared to most of the fire trucks that you see. Do you like the idea of these gigantic windows? Look how big these windows are. Very cool. There's really no metallic sheen here. Maybe a slight one, but nowhere near what the other ones have. The 
plastic though has a metallic sheen all the way throughout the red. It's very cool. I'll be coming off kind of pink on my camera. But I assure you, he's red. It's got an articulated nozzle shooting thing that you can turn sideways and shoot at things. Like if it was water or if it was a laser gun. Yeah, a laser gun. Yeah. That thing. Stays in position fairly well. Pretty cool. Pretty awesome. It's nice to see an action fig feature on a spy changer. And yes, he is kibble tastic. But who cares? We still like it. Anyway, let's go into transformation. Pull it on the legs. Take this portion here. You fold it to the side. And then you can kind of orient it however you want. Some people I know will fold it to like one side and then flip it around and then do this with it. And that's cool and all, but I like to use it for a stand to help him stand up. Pull out on his arms. All his shoulders just clunked out for good. And you can actually separate his legs. It's kind of interesting. So that way it's not some big brick. Because I know some people complain, complain about bricks. I guess what this brick has got rolling heels. Yes, he's his own rocking chair. But, yeah, yeah. Fold this all the way back like this. It stands out just fine, even if you do this. There we go. There is Spy Changer Optimus Prime. R.I.D style very cool got a lot of molded detail going on here do like it like how they picked up all that detail on his head it's very tiny gigantic autobot emblem here very cool from what i've gathered there is no difference between this and the takara release so this literally is the same one by the way all the silver on this thing does have a metallic silver to it so it's very cool it's very awesome but there you go. There is Transformers R.I.D. Spy Changer Car Robots Optimus Prime. I'll catch you guys later. Ta-ta for now!